Artificial intelligence. The artificial intelligence. Artificial intelligence. Chat GPT. Computers are taking over now. Wiping out human jobs. Categories of jobs go away. Other people are just not going to have jobs. Every time a tech giant reveals a new technology, it makes headlines. It starts trending. Everyone's talking about it, tweeting about it, making content about it. And what happens when something's trending? Swarms of VCs come chasing startups that are doing something that aligns with that trend. This is what we're seeing happen right now with AI. बेटा रोजी रोटी के लिए क्या करते हो मैं एक वेब थ्री जवाबर हूँ ये रिश्ता हमें बिल्कुल भी मंजूर नहीं है भाई साहब पहले बताने का यार टाइम वेस्ट करा रहे हो हमारा और इसको ढंग के कपड़े पहना हो जरा भाई बेटा रोजी रोटी के लिए क्या कर रहे हो आजकल अंकल हम एक्चुअली एन ए आई इंजीनियर मैं जब स्कूल में था मैं इंजीनियरिंग कर रहा था वो भी ए वाली तो मैं कॉलेज में गया इंजीनियरिंग करने लग गया ए आई वाली आजकल ए एन आई यू एन बी अंडर जी के आई एस एस आई एस जी अकॉर्डिंग टू पिच बुक विच इज अ डेटा फॉर्म वी सी इन्वेस्टमेंट इन ए आई स्टार्टअप हैज रिजन बाई फोर ट्वेंटी फाइव परसेंट कंपेयर टू ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी बट बिसाइज दीज नंबर इट्स काइंड ऑब्वियस वाई इट्स ऑल कमिंग टूगेदर नाउ कंप्यूटर ग्राफिक्स एंड कॉम्पिटेशन पावर ग्रो एक्सपोनशियली एंड दैट एक्सपोनशियल ग्राफ लुक्स इनसेन especially if we look at it over the last decade the ease of access with which people can order state of the art tech from amazon to run and train the ai models from their bedrooms this has made it possible for developers across the globe to work on multiple open source ai projects like for pilot and dali and make tech even better over time you might think that this is just another hype cycle in 2021 we had web3 now we having ai but with ai that hype is real because ai is useful it solves our everyday problems write an email done design a landing page done help me with coding done it already provides practical value in our lives and businesses you might be skeptical of this hype because the sam backmans use this hype to take your money but the sam altmans and their ais are here to provide value but they might take your job though more on that later sales na marketing na bro इसका तो क्रेजी है। अगेन ब्रो। क्रिप्टो स्कैम ब्रो। एनएफटी बिगर स्कैम ब्रो। एआई। एआई। इसका तो क्रेजी आर ओ आई है तो ए आई इज अ न्यू हॉट थिंग That's great, and there's a lot of money VCs, big companies pouring into it. So, how much can you make as an AI engineer? If you're based in India, you can expect to make up to eight lakhs per year when you're starting out. That's a pretty sweet salary, if you ask me. As you gain experience, you can end up making to a whopping crore in a year. And if you move to the US, you could end up making two crores in a year. And here's the best part: because of the recent global recession, these numbers are artificially lowered. These next two years, these numbers are going to go up by sixty to hundred percent. Do you remember when your friends start posting pictures like this, this, and this? This was created by Lenza AI. This was made possible by nothing short of a revolution in the way AI tools are built. Let me explain. Before, an ML engineer would have to build and train a model on their own, but now they can just use advanced open source AI models and tools like Stable Diffusion and Dream Booth to build on top of it. It's like one guy. makes his own pizza by growing veggies and making his own cheese and the other guy just goes to a store and buys the best ingredients the second method is easier and quicker all this wouldn't be possible without the explosion of open source technology in the field of generative ai mera naam ram murthy hai sir pichle 10 saal se main ai seekh raha hu sir mere khud ke ghar mein fan nahi hai lekin mere pc mein teen fan lagaye hai sir और मैंने ये तीन साल की कड़ी मेहनत के बाद मैंने ये मॉडल बनाया है सर यो व्हाट्सअप मेरा नाम सैम है और मैंने ये किसी राम मूर्ति का मॉडल गिटअप से छाप के मेरे वेबसाइट पे डाल दिया एंड नाउ माय वेबसाइट इज मेकिंग मनी बेबी थैंक यू थोड़ा कम है ये बात करता है आई एम श्योर मोस्ट ऑफ यू आर गोइंग लाइक सो हाउ डू आई गेट स्टार्टेड बिकमिंग एन ए आई इंजीनियर इफ यू आर सीरियस अबाउट परसिविंग ए आई द फर्स्ट थिंग यू मस्ट डू इज इन्वेस्ट इन अ गुड जीपीयू और ग्राफिक कार्ड एंड मेक श्योर यू हैव अ लिनक्स बेस्ड ओ एस और अ विंडोज डब्ल्यू एस एल 
Sure, if you can't really afford these, there's always Google Collab. Google Collab is a website that lets you write, run, and collaborate on programs. It's like a virtual notebook where you can write down your ideas and experiments and then run them to see what happens. After that, you have to start building models using code to achieve specific tasks like generating images or sorting YouTube videos according to genre. These models work like this. You build a base model, feed us some training data, train for a period, and constantly keep fine-tuning the model to get more accurate at achieving your task. Now you understood the tech, let's move to the skills. Number one, programming language. We recommend Python because it's beginner friendly and the syntax is very similar to English. Number two, machine learning course. Making friends with machine learning is one of the best courses out there to get you started. And the best part, it's free, bro. Number three, APIs. The OpenAI API and the Stable Diffusion API are also equally great places to get started for beginners. Now, once you've acquired these skills and learned a few things, you need a playground to test and build. Number four, IDEs. Replit is one of the best cloud-based IDEs out there. You don't even need a computer start. You can write code from your iPad or tablet. They've recently introduced Ghostwriter, an AI code assistant similar to GitHub Copilot, built for their IDE. Number five, say hello to open source projects. An open source project is basically a project where anyone can use its tools to study, modify, and distribute your project to create anything on top of it. The whole community builds it. Our top three recommendations for open source projects are DALI Mini, Hugging Face, and Deep Face Live. Number six, data sets. As we previously mentioned, you need to feed your model training data. So you'll need to find large data sets for your specific project. Kaggle, Lion, Hugging Face, and Google Dataset Search are great places to find data sets of all kinds. Lastly, number seven, the communities. Open Data Science, Data Science Central, Global Data Science Forum, and subreddits like machine learning, writing prompts, and artificial intelligence are good places to find the right people. Every time there's a new technology, whether it's the discovery of fire or the internet, the world changes. Same with AI, the world has changed. Google and Microsoft are in a race to dominate this new AI universe. And they're going all out and they're not afraid of spending big money. Pretty soon, AI will be powering your phones, TVs, cars, cameras, and everything. कैसे है मेहता साहब कैसे है कैसे कैसे मेरे बेटे से मिला आप प्रियल अभी इंजीनियरिंग कराई लड़के को वाईफाई ठीक कर लेता है कंप्यूटर चला लेता है टाइपिंग आती है क्वालिटी वाली कुछ भी मिक्सर टीवी रिमोट कुछ भी खराब हो मुझे याद करिएगा किसे याद करेंगे मुझे हाँ अभी देखो आईफोन रेड भी दिलाया लड़के को नया कैसे है मेहता साहब बहुत टाइम हो गया मिले आप मेरे नए बेटे से मिले चैट जी एक्टर डायरेक्टर प्रोड्यूसर डॉक्टर पायलट इंजीनियर सब कुछ है ये आपकी जॉब भी खा जाएगा मेरी जॉब भी खा जाएगा मेरा राज दुलारा बेटा पापा पर आपका राज बेटा तो मैं था ना पूरा दिन पापा। करता रहता निकल मेरी मम्मी ना माने तो मैं निकाल दू घर से हाँ तो मैं तो साहब मैं कह रहा था आप भी ले लो एक बढ़िया सा चैट जीपीटी आपकी जॉब सेफ रहेगी एकदम हंड्रेड परसेंट The World Economic Forum predicts that 85 million jobs will be taken over by AI by 2025. But the same report also states that 97 million new jobs will be created by this new technology. So what will that mean for us? This could be your chance to take the lead in AI. By 2024, there'll be an abundance of jobs available in the AI sector, from machine learning engineers and data scientists to deep learning engineers to big data architects. But is it true that AI can really match humans? at what they do. If you're wondering if AI can actually match what a human can do, take a look at these paintings and tell me which one was AI generated. It's this one. You couldn't tell the difference? Maybe an AI should replace you. Well, recent advancements like DALI, Stable Diffusion, and ChatGPT have created content that is sometimes better and more human than what humans can make. So we think the argument that AI can replace humans is definitely real. Summing up, Microsoft and Google are battling it out for AI supremacy and VCs will invest more and more money into AI startups while Meta is still stuck in the metaverse. Oh, this is just in. Meta has also pivoted their focus from the metaverse to AI. Why is it still called Meta? That's for another video. If you like this one, subscribe.